Outdoor Travel Channel with Robin Sherry. Before we get started, please take the time to subscribe, then click on the bell icon to get notified of our future videos. This video is made possible by Ranger Rob Poopy Bags, available on Amazon right now. The following intro I'm going to play for you is a, inspired from a show I used to call Imagine 180, and it was about a law of attraction and uh, living a full life. And so, uh, anyway, here it is. How many dreams never come true? How many businesses are never launched? How many books were never written? And how many places have never been traveled? And most of all, how many stories were never told? So you can see that was taken in the middle of a cemetery. And sorry about the, the wind. And uh, it was kind of creepy when we uh, <laughs> filmed that. But it was about uh, following your dreams making sure you didn't die and realize you had a lot of what ifs in your life. And so uh, for Outdoor Travel Channel, we, since Sherry and I are kind of in between our traveling time, um, we've had a show called RV Talk Radio. And we talk about the pros and cons of whether you want a full time or not with an RV. And uh, it's hot outside, by the way. Um, and it's a little windy. I'm here in uh, Arizona and it's only 110 degrees out. Anyway, so a lot of times we talk about things that are uh, positive or negative and a lot of times we try to warn people what's good or bad and, and what I wanted to point out was is when we do shows that maybe not be pro RV or pro certain things, I think it comes from um, experience because sometimes you can follow dreams and be really blind and then find yourself in a situation you didn't want to be in but the other t times I've done things that are pretty crazy because I've owned several businesses and I've worked for big companies and stuff uh, boy, it's gonna be breezy out here so I hope this doesn't mess up my recording too much um, I'm gonna try to keep my camera out of the Sun but my point being is uh, it's good to follow your dreams. It's good to go after those, what if I would, would have done this? So what if I would have done that in life? And uh, uh, I think we've all gone through that. And RVing and nomads and living in vans and stuff like that, I get concerned. Not that I don't think people should do it. But I just know that when I was younger, sometimes I couldn't think all the things all the way through because I was young and didn't have experience. Doesn't mean that young people can't make good decisions. Don't get me wrong. But now when you get older, it's easier to envision cause and effect. If you decide to go this direction, these things will happen and you don't nail it perfectly the world is unpredictable sometimes but uh i always urge everybody don't go through life saying what if i would have done this what if i would have started a business what if i went traveling what if i didn't what if i bought a house what if i went with a nine to five job for 20 years then did something what if i started a business from home even though i still work for someone else um, but the big thing is gamble a little, um, but know what your odds are. And uh, the last thing you want to do is be buried six feet under and people looking down at you going, he had so many wishes, he wanted things he wanted to do and he never did it. He never traveled. He never started a business. He never sold the poopy bags like he wanted to. Whatever. And so uh, even at my age, 
I'm still doing things that I want off of my bucket list. Uh, the last one was obviously and still is the Ranger Rob poopy bags and it's an educated guess. Um, it could fail but it's off my checklist. So what do you have on your checklist? Is it just sitting on the table getting dust on it? Or are you working on it? That's my message. Take the gamble. Be careful. Plan it out. Surround yourself with knowledgeable people. Listen to both pros and cons of everything. And make your own decision. I think that would be some good advice for anyone. So guys, I'm Rob. Thanks for listening. Have a great day. Bye now. Thank you for watching our video. Please take the time to like, subscribe, and share our videos all over. Then go down to the description and think about becoming a member of our Patreon. This will allow you to get special content just for you and help us build future content. Thank you.